Action. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, and welcome to another video. We're in the garden again because it's very sunny. It is, it's lovely. Put your sun cream on. Your SPF is 150. <laughs> sure. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's Wednesday, so it's a shipping day, and we've got nine orders, mm -hmm. 11 total, but two haven't been paid for. Yeah. Um, so we're just going to go through, show you what's sold, sold, tell you how much it's gone for and if we can remember how much we paid. Hopefully. Hopefully. I can never remember. No, I know. <laughs> I know. Some of them stick in your mind, but a lot. Just... Yeah. But some of the stuff has been featured on videos. So yeah, some of them have been be quite look. recent turnovers. Yeah. So we'll go in the garage and we'll show you what's sold. So first thing is this, which I picked up at the car boot on Sunday. A uh, Hemsworth car boot. Uh, it's a Maxi Micro T-Bar scooter in raspberry colour, or pink, if that suits, you know. <laughs> he said, come here. Raspberry Come here. Colour. I just want to prove. <laughs> Look. Raspberry. <laughs> See? You could have come fit on. <laughs> well, make a bigger, bigger, bigger badge then. <laughs> anyway, um, I paid £15 for this, and this is sold for £50? 40, 40 pounds. So, good little buy and a quick turnaround as well. Uh, good slash bad news. The castle is sold. This is one that hasn't been paid for, but Jess has just told me that it's been paid for. I'm pretty sure it's just after. Yeah, so this is going to need. Oh, God. What the hell? I, I don't know what happened there. Um, paid 10 pounds and it's sold for 52 pounds plus postage. So, another really, really good buy and sale. But. Obviously, it's going to have to be packaged as best as I possibly can. See how well we can do. Okay, update on this. All the boxes that we've got are massive. So I've had a look at the address and it's Mansfield. And Mansfield isn't too far away at all. So I'm thinking I might contact the buyer and see if they're happy for me to drop it off in a range of time. Because just the chances of, um, the chances of this making it in one piece, I think, is a struggle. So... I'll go down that road, and if they say no, we'll find another solution. But I think it'll be fine. This has gone for... Just tenner. We had a bunch of these. Um, and I think we had four, and this one was the only one that was working. Oh. Um, got two books. It's just not overly amazing, so we went for a tenner. Ten pound in our pocket there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we picked them up real cheap. Yeah. Pound pound or so each I think. Cool. So starting from the bottom, Maisto Ferrari Diecast Metal Model Kit has gone for £17. Um, where might that be? Ah, there you go. Looks like a Ferrari. This is, as it says really, it's, it's a model kit and it was um, just opened but not really used i think there were one or two parts that had popped out of like the plastic tray like you get in an airfix kit um but it's basically brand new so nice little sell out for 17 pounds i'm pretty sure i paid a fiver for this so what's that 12 pound profit minus the fees uh next on the list harry potter and the prisoner of azkaban pc cd rom complete 5.99 paid a pound or something jess would you say yeah 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 so that should be in the relatively organised section here. It looks like it's there. Oops. Oh, oh. There we go. That one? There we go. Easy. My favourite list is the Dinosaur Train Large Interactive Talking Boris T Rex. Bless him. Paid about three pounds and he's gone for fourteen and ten plus postage. I've obviously pulled the short straw because I bet he doesn't fit in any boxes. <laughs> I'm surprised actually that he's gone for fifteen pounds because um, there's quite a lot on and some were cheaper, some were um, you know around the fifteen pound mark. But I, I, I think something like this is probably promoted listings helping out. I think. Yeah. Yeah. So. Just will enjoy packaging that, won't Jess? Yeah. Oh, uh -huh. we do it fairly, so we start from the bottom and take it in turns, and whatever comes next, that's whose turn it is to ship. I thought Jess got the short straw with poor old Boris here, but actually, I've got this crane. What and a the shame. crane is... Do you know where the crane is? Oh, he's here. Oh, no. And that doesn't come apart, I don't think. Oh, but price-wise, um, it's gone for £18, I think that said. Yeah. 
18 pounds and again that was really cheap i was surprised because that's proper vintage fisher price toy in really good condition with a figure as well um it was cheap four pounds i guess well we did have two boxes that fit a little bit bigger than i thought but that's got the fisher price crane in it and this one has got boris the dinosaur so two good boxes there as i say i didn't really want to use them but hey ho um next two so i've got this short straw oh, it's not too bad though um jess has got this one which is some lego base plates and i've got this which is a really nice sale 39.99 for this super slot triple thunder like a mini um casino slot machine and um, so they shouldn't be too bad and then a couple more to do base plates as part of our tons of lego that we've got yeah i'm just concerned i don't know if that was like that oh, really? I'll let you sort that one out. Um, the slot machine, here we go. Slot machine. So right, I'll show you this because this is pretty cool. So. Here we go. Um, it ain't got any batteries in it, but it comes with loads of fake coins, which is just like a slot machine. Put the coin in there, do that turns out winnings if you win really really cool it's in really really nice condition um again this was pretty cheap i might have paid 10 with 10 to 40 pounds really happy with that really nice sale had this quite a while not a fail but pretty much got money back maybe a little bit of change as well um winnie the pooh royal dalton christening gift set it's a really nice little set i thought it'd be worth more but unfortunately not I think that's down here behind the horse somewhere. Excuse me, horse. Yeah, really nice thing. Just not got much value, unfortunately. Uh, this is just sold. I've had this absolutely ages. Um, seems to have quite a bit of value, mainly in the States. Um, Calico or Caliso kittens. Um, it's in pretty good condition, a little bit dusty, we've had it a long time. Seven pounds it's just gone for. Jess has got. <laughs> <laughs> Real happy about that, ain't you? Well, that's it for today. We'll get those labels, get them sent off. Hopefully, I can deliver this one. I mean, hand delivered. Can't get much better service than that, can you, Jess? No. Just a lot of fun doing the cat. Um, I might go in that one. Yeah, it's pretty bad though. So. Um, yeah. What we'll do? Um, thanks to Eddie, who gives us a comment on pretty much Eddie every video. Eddie video, every video. Um, his suggestion on the last one was to link all of our stores. So we'll do exactly that on this video. So if you check out the description, um, it'll have a link to our eBay store, our Instagram and our Facebook page. So please, if you get a moment, um, have a look at our shop and have a look at our, bless you. Make sure it's well packaged, or she. It. It. Um, check them out, give us a follow. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. You say bye, Jess. Bye. <laughs>